okay, Ronches, Ronches Global Resources, the company owned or said to be owned by Pastor Adeolu Adeboe, who is the son of that Gio Adeboe of RCCG. You know, the Sarah Reporters report last week said EFCC define Adeolu Adeboe because. Contracts, when every government give a company, they not do the contract. They do the contract, which 40%, I mean, 60%, and then they abandon the contract after they don't collect 8 billion or 8 billion. Anyway, long story short, people start to drag Pastor Adeolu at the boy. say, no one die. Your papa said a special problem the country gets. The news by Sarah reporters even said that Pastor Adeolu at the boy, had gone to the Lagos High Court to stop EFCC from probing him. Anyway, Rochelle Global Resources has responded to the case. They said a lie. Question is, what is a lie? On a collect contract, I mean, not collect. They said they collect. They counted all the contracts they don't collect. They counted the ones they have done complete and the ones they have not done complete. And they explained why they have not done each one complete. Many of the contracts where they say they never do complete. They say the road they're supposed to government supposed to compensate people where get houses beside the road. Government never compensate them. That's why they not do the road. Some of the contracts they say government have not paid them enough money to pass the level where they do the contract reach. But as for that, Usasa Road, when Sarah reporters report about they not talk why they never do that one. Anyway, another thing where they say a lie. They say. Pastor Adolu Adeboye was not a part of the company as of when the company collected that contract. They say company collected contracts in year 2000. I mean, I told the collection contracts from 2018 to 2000. Pastor Adolu Adeboye was not a part of the company that time, no being at the company that time. He only joined the board of the company in 2022, which means. He either bought shares or he was made a board of director and they suspect he buy shares. Now, what the company is tell, simply telling us is that as I want to collect this contract, this man never be owner out for this company. He just joined the board of director after we done the fight this call already. Now, when you buy a house, you buy the liabilities and the assets. You know what that means? If you buy land, anything on the land belongs to you. If the land get court case, now you get an If the land have freehold, now you get an If the land get crude oil, it is your land now. Also, when you buy a company, every problem the company gets before you come, now you get out. Every money the company gets after you come, now you stick before you come, now you still get out. So if Ronchas Global is telling us that Pastor Adi Oluadeboye was not a part of this company as of when the company collected the contract, now that he's a part of the company, he's on the board of directors, he's part of the people who have owned the liabilities of the company. That's a sign. Sarah reporters, why on a call only in him? Because when Sarah reporters report the news just now, they make us sound like saying, I ain't the author and finisher of the country, of the company. Now he get 100% shares. So if he's not the only owner of the company, why did you only call his name? Because at the year for back door. Now, say some other people are part owners of the company. So why did they bring Pastor Adeolu Adeboe's name forward? Now because I name popular and I ain't go feel same news. As for Pastor Adeolu Adeboe and your company, the time one at all writes the press statement, one at all defend Pastor Adeolu Adeboe. When I for use our attend to EFCC, when EFCC be called on But when I on go court, if you are not the owner of the company, they are calling you, you are not the owner of the company at that time, they are calling you now to come and explain, simply go to the EFCC and say, we will check our documents. This was why we could not execute the contract at so-so time. As of that time, I wasn't the owner of the company. Now that I have come, this is what I'm requesting from the government, this is what we will do, this is what we will do. Why are you referring on go court? Say me there no problem. All of them, both EFCC, both Sarah reporters, no, EFCC never even get fought. Both Kaduna State government, both Sarah reporters, both Pastor Adeoye, Olu Adeoye, all of them, when I never talk with you, and they do, all of them, we go still find that, we they watch.